Hey y'all. So I want to say disclaimer real quick. Please forgive me for keep touching my hair. I'm looking at this video like why do I keep touching my hair? But it's because I need my hair done. My OGs know how I get when my hair isn't done. I'm literally looking at my hair almost the whole time that I'm talking to y'all. So please don't get distracted by that. Pay attention to what's going on. Pay attention to what I'm trying to say. Okay, what I am saying because I'm dropping some gems on you girls. Okay, and also forgive me for my makeup, y'all. I'm trying to get back into the groove of everything. Y'all know I've been slow and down and I'm trying to get back to y'all. Okay, I'm trying. I'm at first i wasn't even gonna post this at first i was like oh no i need to re-record but the show must go on i told y'all i was gonna post so that's what i'm gonna do so here y'all go okay love y'all and one more thing you guys i know you guys can see how late i'm posting this i have been completely busy today i could have made any excuse of why i wasn't going to edit and post this video but i did not do that so i'm gonna need y'all to watch this video from start to finish i'm gonna need y'all to like comment and if you are new subscribe i love y'all so so much thank you guys for the continual support especially from my ogs i love y'all and i will catch y'all love y'all queen and i am back with another video all right you guys so as y'all can tell from the title what we are going to be getting into today so it's been a while it has been a long time since i have came and talked to you guys about this and i just can't i can't let it go one y'all not letting me let it go because y'all are still in my dms on Instagram still asking me if I have my group chat and for those of y'all that don't know I do have a group chat you guys I have a prison group chat after I was going through all the things that I was going through with my relationship with the person that was in prison no I did not meet him while he was in prison I met him while he was outside of prison but i didn't know him very long but i decided to hold him down because that's just the type of person that i was okay what after i was going through some after so after i ended up being in that situation i decided to make i decided to make a youtube channel and my youtube channel pretty much blew up it was so many females so many ladies basically going through the same things that I had already went through and the things that I were I was currently going through at that moment. So I decided to make a girls group for and it was I also welcome men too, but they just didn't but men also have commented um uh, men have also DM'd me about certain things that they have went through as well. So it's not always just the females, but it ended up just being that way to where only females wanted to be in the group. Y'all know how men are, they're not too, they don't have too many emotions and plus y'all know the men, they probably were, was doing them. They weren't worried about none of that. So y'all know how that go. I decided to start doing classes and basically just helping out the girls basically helping them budget their person in phone calls all that stuff can be high especially for the girls who didn't get the men that know how to get in there and make some money okay because some of us were lucky that we didn't have to all the time okay some people knew how to some people just know how to get in there and just get it period so but for those of y'all that were that were or are unfortunate and have to you know pay a little bit of money then basically i just helped you be able to budget that in without getting broke um showing you different strands of income that you can do quick strands of income legal ways to get money quick money fast money the girls find lawyers like literally the whole nine so if you want to join one of my classes you can do that just go and hit up my instagram i'm going to put that right here 
So moving along, while we're hitting on that subject, I am going to be starting back classes, you guys. So if you have never did one of my classes, then it is going to be a small fee. It's a small fee to enter one of my classes, but if you have not join one of my classes you guys and you cannot join the girl group you cannot do that you can't you can't you can't you have to take a class first and then i will put you in the group with the other girls so i also have to make my group active again i slowly i have been going through a little bit of stuff personal things so I kind of fell off from my group, but hey y'all, I miss y'all, so if y'all watching me, I love y'all and I will be back, I promise. I know y'all be checking on me and making sure I'm good. I'm fine, I'm getting back to the grind, getting back to everything and we are good, you guys. But back up and running, but like I said, if you have never joined one of my classes, you have to join one of my classes, just go ahead and hit me up on Instagram all right now. And... We will. So a couple of things that I want to share with you girls and you guys as well is to be careful. Please do not date somebody who you met in prison. Don't do it, y'all. First of all, don't. I'm not going to say don't because if you're married, that's a whole nother thing. If you're already mar married when you go into this, that's a it's a different topic. But since I am seasoned, I am a vet in this I'm going to let y'all know that it's a 50-50% chance that you are wasting your time. Let me just be honest, and I'm just going to keep it straight up with y'all. It's a 50-50%, and it's probably higher than that, but I'm just trying to be nice. It's a 50-50% chance that you are right now wasting your time, and I know you don't want to hear that. And you might scroll off this video, you might click to the next video. You might say, oh, well, she don't know what she's talking about. Trust me, boo. I know, what I'm, I know what's going on. Just be careful. Look for all the red flags. Don't say, oh, just because they're in there. They're going through a lot of stuff. So, and just excusing shit. Because it's going to be no different when they get out. It's just going to be, it's going to be no different. It will probably just get worse. Let me just say that. So just be careful, y'all. And I'm not trying to um I'm not trying to be rude. I'm not trying to tell nobody what to do, but I'm just literally trying to guide y'all in the right direction because I didn't have nobody to do that for me. I didn't have anybody saying, well, this could happen, so be careful. I didn't look at videos, I was just making my own videos, and you guys are watching me. Well, some of y'all are watching me. And I was literally going through the motion, going through the process. You guys seen when he got released, I, you saw the whole process of what I was going through. I wasn't watching other videos, y'all. <laughs> I was just going through the motions, recording myself, and that was it. So what I'm telling y'all right now is just to be careful be careful and please don't waste your time because you will look up and it will be years gone. And when they get home, you will, you will probably regret a lot of it. Okay. And I'm just being completely honest. I'm just being completely honest. I have to be, um, and I used to coddle, coddle y'all a lot and be like, well, okay, you gonna hold your man down. You gonna do this, you gonna do that. And some, some of them really do get out and have common sense, but a lot of them just don't, you know, a lot of them just straight up don't. So just be careful. Um, if you are planning on going to visitation, let's hit up visitation real quick. And I think this might be the last topic that I talk about. But if you are planning on going to visitation, just no, don't wear anything white. You can still wear cute stuff, but just make sure your pants don't have any like cargo pockets and stuff. Make sure they're not too tight. You know how the baggy jeans and stuff are now, like the real cute baggy jeans and stuff. Wear that um, for your top. Like I said, don't wear white. Don't wear hard to tops, don't wear spaghetti straps. Just put on like something cute. 
not too fitting but fitting you know you can still go up there looking cute but just be cautious of what you wear when you go in make sure that you only have your id your keys your ID, your keys, and your glasses or your rings if you wear them. Other than that, not rings like a wet like a wedding ring you can have on, but other than that, everything else just keep it in the car. Don't bring nothing else in. And I know I'm kind of like jumping all over the place, but this is just going to be my intro into getting back on on this topic. So yeah. So visitation, visitation is, can either be on the screen or it can be in person. So mine was on screen. I never was able to be in person. I was never able to hug them. I was never able to actually like really see them. What I used to do y'all, and I'm going to show y'all. So y'all need to be keeping up with me, okay? We are back on our shit. We are back helping the girls, okay? Um, I used to pull up to the jail and there was a side, there was a side road that I could go to that was right by his window. So I'm giving y'all game, okay? There's a way to go see him, okay? I used to go to, um, it was like a back, like it was on the highway, but it was like on the highway, right in between like the jail. So I could go up towards the jail and like the grass and the window was like right up there. I have a video on that too, so y'all need to go. This window was right there, so I would be there and he would be on the phone, like I would be on the phone. I'm like, I'm outside. So he would run to the window, he would wave, I would wave, we would like do hearts and stuff like that. And um, he would run back to the run back to the phone and I would be on the phone. And he'd be like, you look so beautiful. Da, da, da. Like it used to be like a really good time. But at the same time, you just got to know that if you just want like a little companion for the time being, then that's really what that shit is for. If you just want somebody to talk to, to if you want somebody to talk to, to vent to, that's a good person to to, you know, but as far as being serious with them, sis, I'm sorry to let you know, but it's probably not a good idea. And let me give y'all a quick story time before I get off of here. So I went to, it was this girl that was on TikTok and she was talking about her, you know, her relationship, her man was locked up or whatever. And I forgot exactly what I said, but I was basically trying to give her like some pointers of what I went through. Nothing too invasive because I didn't know her. She didn't ask for my, she didn't ask for, you know, me, my help or nothing like that. But I just decided, you know, to, I was going to give her some free game real quick. So I was just trying to give her some free game and so I don't know if she, I think she blocked me. I don't really know how TikTok go, y'all. I haven't really been on TikTok in a minute. So, well, I haven't been like, you know, one day I know she gonna look back and she gonna think back and she gonna be like, that girl, that one girl was trying, she was trying to help me out. She wasn't getting on there hating. She wasn't getting on here. I have been through the shit. You get what I'm saying? I'm not, but I get where she could feel attacked because there's so many people who attack attack people who are going through that situation so i i definitely got it so i mean but one day boo i'ma still be right here you can come talk to me and tell me but i i really do hope everything works out i really do i hope everything works out for her i'm not gonna wish anything bad i'm not gonna you know because you just really never know she might have a good one so yeah y'all but like I said, this is just gonna be the intro of me getting back onto here. I am going to start back my girl group for my old girls, for my OGs. I need y'all to come back as well. I need y'all to come and put some game on the new girls and just let them know what's up. Let them know what y'all been through. You know, we can all help each other. So I want to go ahead and start this community up again because I have a lot planned for us. So we need to go ahead and start here. We need to go ahead and start now. So if you are new to this, 
go ahead and hit me up on Instagram so we can go ahead and get you in this class so y'all can go ahead and get in the girls chat okay but I love y'all and I will talk to y'all later thank y'all so much for being here keep your head up y'all got this whatever you want to do whatever you're inspired to be you can do it just stay focused we ain't got time to sleep okay sis we we can't sleep we'll, we'll sleep when we have the things that we want okay my phone's gonna die y'all but i love y'all and i will talk to y'all later peace